The technology has been rebuilt from scratch. It's really another dimension. We want to offer freedom. Nothing was reused from previous versions, everything is new. We are using plenty of uh, new shaders, the levels have more poly count. It uh, looks good, it feels good, it feels very acrobatic, very arcade -ish. We have also brought a lot of new elements to multiplayer. Multiplayer has been one of the strongest focus of what we are doing now. Our philosophy is to go along the lines of credibility, depth and freedom. And the feature that illustrates the best our philosophy is the physics system. For the first time, Asphalt will be a fully driven uh, by physics game. This allows also the designers to create crazy stuff that before it wasn't possible. It's a permanent challenge for the player to discover the possibilities of the car. We are pushing the technologies of the devices to the limits. They look uh, far better than what we have done so far in Asphalt 7. Uh, in Asphalt 8, you feel uh, the wheels. You feel the car. We want a game that's easy to get in, but difficult to master. This changes everything, basically, because the driving experience will change. Uh, what the player will feel while playing is different completely from the previous versions. And really, it looks like a totally new dimension, racing much closer to what a console can offer to you.